Feeling like we're superstars, superstars Paparazzi, special lines, special lines So roll with the red carpet now Hello guys, Little G Thunder back at it again with another video. In today's video, we are going to be watching an extreme feminist video, I Hate Men Part 3. How does it feel to be the same sex as Donald Trump? This video is called 36 Questions Women Have for Men. And oh my god, I probably just butchered that or whatever, but I guess that's what the video is called, I think, from the title. And yeah, I probably just butchered that. Yeah, it doesn't matter because they're fucking feminists. Who cares about them? Yeah, they always have something to fucking say about us. So, um, I'm just gonna go ahead and defend my side and let's see what they have to say. Let's get to the video. How does it feel to be the same sex as Donald Trump? Bitch, how does it feel to be in the same sex as Hillary Clinton? Oh, I'm sorry. Was not was I not supposed to step there? Oh shit, I'm sorry. Damn. Gosh, my bad. I didn't I didn't mean to do that. The most generic intro of all time. Why do you hate rom-coms? Or do you just feel like you need to hate them? Everybody likes The Notebook. Everybody likes Beyonce. So is this is relevant to the uh, men video? Why is this relevant? Does everybody likes Beyonce or women like Beyonce? What are you trying to get at here? Gosh, I know many people who I barely talk to. I mean, shoot, at least I know they want to marry Beyonce. There are people who want to marry freaking Ariana, marry Beyonce, freaking fuck Nicki Minaj, man. It's, it's all kinds, man. So don't you dare go out there and say men don't like Nicki Minaj or Ariana Grande or Beyonce because that's like every man's dream. Gosh, they would love to at least, they would like to at least be face to face with them. Personally, I don't like any of those people, you know, I'm a 90s rap music type guy, so I mean, I doubt anybody cares about that, but back to the video. It's just a fact. Why do you make women sit around and talk about men in movies when y'all easily just sit around and talk about boobs for hours? Oh, okay, that makes complete sense. Okay, so you guys saying you guys don't do the same fucking thing, talk about how fucking your, your fucking standards and how muscular we need to be for your goddamn standards. I like my man chocolate. I like my man white. I like the buff. I like them this. They gotta have a nice personality. They, they gotta be bigger. They gotta be this. They gotta be that. Well, okay, let me go ahead and play my side. Here, let, let's let's make up my standards. You gotta be Latina. You gotta have big boobs. You gotta have a big ass. Yeah, how do you feel, huh? Jesus Christ. Gosh, personally, I don't have that many standards. You just gotta fit my personality and I gotta be comfortable around you. But gosh, you guys don't act like you guys don't judge us or anything. You guys act like you guys bring 110 to the table to the world and society every single day. What are you talking about? It's an unfair world and you guys are complaining about it. Jesus Christ, you guys are horrible. Just go die, gosh. I mean, jeez. The hell? Why do you automatically assume that you won't like TV or movies that star a female lead? Why Oh my god, dude, what is this video? Oh my goodness. Okay, personally, I love The Conjuring 2 with the little girl. Hell yeah, you're next. Taxi with Queen Latifah. Come on now. You you guys got to be kidding me, right? You, you guys got to be kidding me. Got to be kidding me. Got to be kidding me. Why are you surprised when women are funny? I'm probably funnier than you. You know what? Everybody here is very fucking bad, but you right here, you in particular, you are the worst feminist in, in the on the internet. On the internet. Is it funny? You're gonna base comedy off this. Why do you think that we're obsessed with you when we hook up? And I thought men couldn't read women. Jesus Christ. Nine times out of ten, I just want you to leave too. I'm busy. I got shit to do. Why can't I sleep with as many people as I want to without being judged? Alright, that's it. Hold the fuck on. Okay. First of all, you're stupid. Second of all, you're stupid. Third of all, you're fucking stupid. Okay, now let- Okay, I'm serious. Check this out. You don't go around and tell people like who you've been sleeping with and shit without somebody getting judged. You expect somebody to give you a gold medal and be like, congratulations on your success on sleeping with different guys. No, that's not how the world works. That ain't right. That ain't right. It don't work like that. 
Jesus Christ. If you don't want people to go around and tell you how much of a slut you are, big slut, whatever, then don't go around and tell everybody how many guys you've been sleeping with. Gosh, common sense, dude, seriously. When men do it, they're congratulated. When women do it, they're congratulated too. So what's the point? What's your point? Why do you consider a woman a tease if she doesn't sleep with you after three dates, but a slut if she sleeps with you on the first date? Check this out. I have never heard of such BS in my entire fucking life. What kind... You know what? I blame BuzzFeed for this. I, I blame BuzzFeed. You're the reason why my life is like this right now. I want to kill myself so bad. You know what? Fuck this shit. In what world does no mean yes? No means no. Why do you say that women are too emotional to be leaders? Then justify catcalling by saying men just can't control themselves. Why do you think that just because you're nice to me, I owe you my body? Why would you ever send an unsolicited dick pic? Why do you feel like it's okay to harass women or make offensive comments about women, but when somebody does it to your sister, it's not okay? How I am just totally fucking speechless right now. I, I can't I can't do this anymore. Like if I end the video early, I'm sorry. Like this is this is honestly fucking sad that women have to go up here and say this kind of shit and base it all of sex and shit like that. It's just stupid. Why? Like I said earlier, it's an unfair world. Deal with it. And I'm not saying all the shit they say is true. I'm not I'm I'm not saying that at all. They're just being stupid. Like stupid ass feminists. This this is what we gotta deal with the world. How does it feel to interrupt me when I'm in the middle of making a point during a meeting? Why do you have to sit with your legs so wide open? Why do you have to sit with your legs so wide open? There are people die every day people who die every single fucking day but BuzzFeed is worried about men sitting with their legs wide open I uh, I need some water I need some motherfucking water man this is ridiculous I get that you have balls but I don't stand around with my arms wide open to make room for my boobs. Fuck that shit! I know so many fucking girls that do that! And shoot, people, men don't even look at that kind of shit! Jesus Christ, now from what I've seen, it's like, oh, sit with your arms spread the fuck open like this! And it's like, oh, okay, well, alright. You know, it's not noticeable! And neither is men sitting with their legs open! Jesus Christ! Feminists notice such little, 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 little things. Gosh, I can go and start snapping my fingers and they'll be like, Oh, so I'm a, uh, I'm a dog, huh? You're, you're this, this, and that? You're treating me like a pet, huh? You're doing this, 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 and that? No, stop. I was just snapping my damn finger. Jeez, I could be walking, leaning back in the hallways, and they'd be like, Oh, so you think I'm a hood rat? Wait, wait, whoa, 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 wait a second. Hold on, pause. Wait a minute. I, I, I'm just leaning back because my leg hurt. Jesus Christ. You know, football injuries, such and such and such. She's like, oh, well, I'm reporting you this, this, and that. Whoa, hold on for a quick minute. Jeez. You guys notice the littlest upon littlest stuff that we don't even intentionally do that you guys go and complain about. Why are women perceived as the weaker sex? Now women are looked upon as the weaker sex. Alright, check this out. Women are not looked upon as the weaker sex. Well, to probably some men. But in my view, I know women are not looked upon as the weaker sex. Women actually have power and fuck it, they can... I know so many women that whoop my ass, Jesus Christ. I'm not exactly a fighter myself. And I know many women that could throw down. Shoot, there are women in the UFC that could whoop... Like, what is wrong with y'all? Y'all don't look around and y'all only look on what's in front of you and not what's around you. Why is it your first instinct to doubt women who have been sexually violated? Why is it your first instinct to doubt women who have been sexually violated? Why is it your first instinct to doubt women who have been sexually violated? Your first instinct.
think to doubt women who have been sexually violated? What kind of sense or what point are you trying to bring? This doesn't make any sense. You're over here trying to say women are doubted because they got raped. Okay, well I might as well pull a Ted Bundy and go kill somebody, kill some woman at a hotel and so the world can doubt her. Men are seen as bosses. Why aren't you speaking up when you hear your male friends behind closed doors make jokes that are offensive to women? Why are you First of all, who has that kind of conversation with their friends? Second of all, we do it because they're closed doors! Like you guys don't do that all the time, you guys are doing it in this video! Come on now, you guys gotta be kidding me, you hypocritical feminist bastards. Come on, man. Why are you so afraid of recognizing your own privilege? Doesn't mean you're a bad person. Just recognize it and do something about it. I don't get it, man. Just this video truly, truly pissed me off. Oh my fucking god. Anyways, if you guys like this feminist video, if you guys learn how to stand up for yourself, please leave a like and subscribe, you know, for this kind of fuck shit. And deuces!